You don't meet many hunters who don't love their food. Kai Ap Brin has taken his passion and turned it into a business, serving up pigeon wraps, pulled boar and venison burgers to hungry pro-game meat punters. Back at home my, with my business, I do mainly like street food style catering. That's what I do. And I'm looking for ways I can maybe incorporate some of the Hungarian cuisine into some of the street food. Give me some ideas and inspirations to make some fantastic dishes. He's after game changers, inspiration to take wild meat to an even wider audience. To kick off, we're in Hungary, home of the boar and mouflon. We're after meat for the grill, but before we get anywhere near the dense forests of the northeast, he's at a brand new shooting range. He's here to learn from one of the best how to shoot an animal that won't sit broadside for three minutes while you deploy the sticks. So we've just arrived here in Hungary. Now, before we get to try the rifle in any game, TAM supports this brand new shooting range so we can zero in the rifle and make sure that we're on check. Not only that, we've got the opportunity to shoot some driven game, simulated driven game that is, something I've never ever done before. Yeah, I do think, I do think, yeah. We're here by invitation from Wonderheart Outfitters. With more and more Brits heading to the continent for boar, they have introduced a new package that includes a day on the range to really get your eye in with a professional instructor. Carroy can even accompany guns on shoot days to offer advice when the action starts. So when you when you hold the rifle with your front hand firm, yeah, your muscles are in tension. Yeah, and when you shoot, you, there's the there's the typical uh, fold pull down. So you, yeah, yeah. So don't don't grip, just just relax. Just, just hold. Yeah. The plus or muscle up. Okay. Uh, this uh, shooting range just uh, built in, in this year, so we can we can practice here for uh, driven boar, which is I think very very important. Good for the hunters, good for the the hunting area, and good for the the outfitter as well. Because uh, we if we come a day before the driven hunt, we can do a, a practice day, and obviously we saw in in. No time, we can uh, make a big improvement. That's good. That's so you start from the back legs? Start, start from the back of the ball. And then work and, up? And work up, yeah. When you reach the, the, the white spot, speed up and shoot and keep swinging. Basically, my first shot was good. The second shot was, I rushed it too far forward. So it was in line, but I literally just rushed it too far forward. And I, I knew I did when I took the shot. So we're going to try again, but the, the ball's going to go from right to left now, the other side. So we'll see how I get on. Shotgun shooters should have the edge, but there's lots to consider. Range for one. Kai shoots at 20 metres and is then moved back to 50. You never know how close those balls are going to appear. Karoy gives us a demo. He competes internationally in disciplines just like this. One thing to notice is the level of his rifle. Even when reloading Kai's Zar 101, he's always looking at the target. For Kai, it's slightly harder. The Zawa may have an ambidextrous stock, but the bolt is the wrong side for him. With only half an hour's tuition, Kai isn't missing. I know it's not driven poor for me this week, but it's given me the confidence if I'm sitting in a hide or the high seat, and there's a trotting ball, and it's my only opportunity, then if I've got to take that shot, then I know the procedure to do that. Not only that, it's good for, for future if I ever come back out here and decide to do a driven hunt, then this knowledge is, is really, really important. We're not here for driven boar, but nobody has told the pigs that. These animals are wild and opportunity is rare, so he needs to feel confident whatever presents itself. So could you give me your five top tips when doing driven boar here in Hungary? You have to arrive in happy attitude. <laughs> <laughs> I'm happy. I've got a big smile on my face. So you need to know your rifle. Yes. You have to follow the instructions. He, he has uh, knowledge, so please... He's please. the expert, so follow, yes, follow his follow steps. Him, yeah. Yeah. So if you if you relaxed and if you follow the instructions, the success is coming. Yeah. Killing the ball with one shot Yeah. quickly. So you, do, you don't need to be try too hard. Mm -hmm. And also you have patience. Patience. Yeah. Of course the health and safety is very important. Yeah. And also we, we teach the health and safety as well. Yeah. 
useful advice, especially the know your rifle. It can happen so fast you can't afford surprises. Next time, Kai gets a taste of the forest. To book your hunting and maybe a shooting lesson, go to wonderhearts.co.uk. To find a new rifle for your trip, go to zawa.de. And to ensure you look smart and stay dry, Kai has been wearing some of the hunting clothing available through shooterking.co.uk.